Welcome, savvy creators. Are you ready to elevate your video editing game and master the art of crafting captivating thumbnails? Whether you're here to learn the secrets behind editing viral professional videos using CapCut PC or to unlock the magic of designing eye-catching thumbnails, you're in for a treat. Stick around until the end because David is about to unveil pro tips and tricks that will take your CapCut PC skills to the next level. Don't miss out on this opportunity to become a true CapCut pro. Let's dive in together. David, it's time for you to use your CapCut PC tutorial skills to create the next best pro video editor. Now, let's go. So you look down here. You see where it says cover. This usually appears on the main video clip. It usually appears there. That does not mean all these other things, all these other unique edits we've done won't appear on it. So we just need to click on that. And it's going to give you two options. Either you go local, all right? Either you go local or you select from video. Obviously, I'm showing you how to do it from video, so I don't need to go local, but you can do it. It's an option. So you just click. So you can select from video. So for me, I can just select one. She's happy if one of these frames, like this one, for instance, she's smiling, she's happy. And then I can just click on edit. So once you click on edit, this is what you get. This is the frame we picked. And then you can choose from different templates depending on what you want. It's totally up to you what you want to do with your thumbnail, what you really want. You can choose different thumbnail and it's going to appear there like so. Depending on what you really want, it's not a complicated process. You might just want it like that. You might want it like this. So all you need to do now when you get to this stage is just to change the text. Like for these, these are the recommended ones. You can scroll down and see more for yourself. And you can just pick from any one that suits you. Like this is another one. For instance, you can just pick. If you want a very simple one like this, you can as well pick that. It's not complicated at all. This is how it's gonna look. It's just you and your creativity and working with what seems to be best for you. So we can use this or we can use this one also. And now you can just move this text downwards. If this is where you want it, you can move the text downward like this. You can actually change the font. You can change the style. You can change things around, All right? You can just, it works just like Canva, but this is directly on CapCut PC. You can then change the font. If you don't want this font, you can change it from here. You can upload extra elements. As you can see, it's more, it's looking like Canva, but this is CapCut working its magic. And once you are done, you can just hit on save and it's going to save it for you. And it's going to be in your video, as you can see here. So now when you export, when you export, like let's try to export and see what happens. When you export this video, for instance, it's going to export two files. One is going to have the cover and one is with the video. So I'll pause this and come back to you when it's done. So we are back. I can now go to my video section. And if I scroll down, this is it. This is the folder. So once I click on that folder, I have it here and here you go. You can see it clearly. This is the thumbnail we created. It's downloaded. It's rendered also with the folder. Okay, so we have it there ready for us to use. Not complicated at all. Right? Not complicated at all. It's super easy. Super easy. As you can see, this is it. It didn't take us a lot of time, about four minutes. That's because I'm just showing you step by step how to do it. Obviously, once you watch this video, you will know how to do it. It won't take you more than two, three minutes to get this done for yourself. And you have your thumbnail and you don't need to go out to create a different thumbnail. I hope this video was helpful. I'll see you on the next one. Stay blessed.